This is my second video on an MSC cruise official ship tour that's offered as an excursion by the cruise line itself. Please watch my review of the ship tour on MSC Meraviglia. Hello everyone, my name is Fatima Mahmoud. Welcome and welcome back to my channel. Welcome to my MSC Seascape 2023 video playlist from end of February to beginning of March featuring the Port of Calls in Ocho Rios, Jamaica, Georgetown, Cayman Island, Costa Maya, Mexico, Nassau, Bahamas, San Juan, Puerto Rico, Puerto Plata, Dominican Republic, in addition to MSC's Ocean K, Marine Reserve, Private Island, and Miami, Florida. Why am I making more cruising videos when there are already so many professional content creators out there? First, I'd like to thank all the professional YouTubers making cruising content that helps people like me get ready for cruising. The pros are better than me for several reasons. They have better professional equipment, they have more experience speaking on camera, filming, editing, and mixing broad strokes narratives with details. My approach is going to be different. I'm gonna focus on details. I'm gonna get into the weeds, show documents because I don't have one platform to show documents. My videos might be shorter or longer depending on the content and they'll be filled with information on first time cruiser anxieties. Sometimes there will be no narration. I hope you enjoy the difference in my approach. Let's get started with this video. This is the destination guide booklet in paper that's available at the excursion desk on board any MSC cruise ship. This is curated for the particular itinerary that you're going on and in this paper is all the descriptions of all the available excursions or potentially available excursions that you could purchase. The prices aren't shown here. If a ship tour is offered it's all the way in the back of the booklet and also you can check on the apps when the app is available on certain ships to find the description and I'll go more into it in a few seconds but basically it tells you here that for part of it you have to wear close show close-toed shoes and that you cannot take your mobile phones and cameras into certain parts of the tour the goal of this is a curated tour by the excursion team and the staff uh, to show you what goes on in the ship. The ship tour excursion is not available on the app or on the web check-in before the cruise for pre-cruise purchase. Obviously they need to figure out the exact timing and dates based on their current itinerary schedule and weather, etc. So the trade-off is once you get on board, then you might know the dates, days, and start times for this tour. But if you already booked excursions through the cruise line or independently, they may conflict with your desire to take this tour. So you have to think about what's more important to you, pre-booking excursions and saving money or waiting to find out details for the official ship tour. I asked the excursion desk about the behind the seas, the ship tour of the MSC Seascape. It was much more well informed than my experience with MSC Miravilia. You can do a combo of the two parts, or you can purchase the two parts separately. And just like the MSC Miravilia, it is two parts. One part is called the hotel, where you see the theater, backstage, laundry, galley, and provision areas. The other part is the bridge and the engine control room only. What I did on the MSC Miravilia was paying for two no one showed me it like this on the Maravilia cruise I'm on a back-to-back -back. they're not going to do the bridge if they do it for the next cruise that I'm on they will they have to do it while they're in port the bridge tours have to be when the ship is in port not sailing they'll confirm by March 9th if they're going to do it when it's in San Juan port the timing this is great she could tell me the timing that would start at 10 25 a.m the hotel tours are on a, the last sea day of the itinerary that you're on so for my two back-to-backs it's march 4th or march 11th and the bridge would be on march 9th which was the san juan day but they have to confirm they tell you it's to break it down this is great that's two hours 
This is one hours and 1.15 hours. And they give you the price breakdown for them, which was not available to me on the MSC Meravillium. So I'm just saying all of that to show compare and contrast across MSC ships. Same cruise line, but different different things happen. So that's something you'll hear a lot, that this line is inconsistent. Thank you for watching my video. I'd love to hear from you on email at fmahmood at wellesley.edu. You can also find me on LinkedIn at that address. And if you do send me a connection request, please go ahead and send me a note. Before you go, please like, comment, share, and subscribe to my channel. I'd really appreciate it. And please go ahead and watch my next video. Thank you.